Pearl Academy conducts its entrance examination for getting an admission into various courses which are related to fashion, design, business and media. If you are aiming to crack this particular entrance examination, make sure that you are watching this video till the end because in this video we are going to cover out the examination pattern as well as the syllabus which is conducted from the Pearl Academy entrance exam. So where can you access all of this information? Everything of this can be accessed only from one space itself that is from exams.preciousnow.com. How can you go there? Before I head forward and show you, I would like to welcome you all to our channel where we provide informative videos regarding entrance exams. And now let's get into the video starting off with Google. So head over to Google and search for Pearl Academy Syllabus Precious Now. As you search, you can see the first link itself is from exams.precious now. Give a click on this and this particular page would be opening up for you. Starting off with the basic introduction as to what the examination is about and for. Then you would be knowing that this examination would be giving out a brief of three types of exams which is called as GPT, DAT and MAT. This would be uh, testing out the applicants or the candidates for their desired courses. As I've said, this is into fashion, design, business, media, etc. Then giving you an overview of the examination. Before we head forward to the details, I would like to request you all to join our telegram channel because in our telegram you are going to get all of the updated news or details regarding the entrance of various entrance exams at one space instantly. Don't forget to join us. Likewise, subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can easily hear out all of the information within one go. Now heading over to the overview. This examination is conducted by Pearl Academy itself and here you have the official website. You can always cross check in case if you want to know about the information regarding this examination even more. This would be giving you an admission to both UG as well as PG alongside with diploma courses as well. So in case look at the standard of the examination or look at the standard of course that you are actually preferring for and then you can head forward or choose the particular level of examination that you want to opt for. Next the examination pattern for UG design courses you have fashion design or fashion accessories and textiles in this particular section you have general proficiency test conducted for one hour design aptitude test conducted for one hour and there would be a personal interview round as well. Next you have communication design, interaction graphics, animation and VFX. In this particular section you have the general proficiency test conducted for one hour, design aptitude test DAAT which is conducted for one hour. Again here also you have the personal interview round. The next one is for fashion styling and image design. You have again uh, GPT and DAT conducted for one hour each with the personal interview. Next again for interior and uh, sapral design, interior architecture and interior designing. Then GPT and DAT one hour each with the personal interview. For fashion, media and communication also it is the same. For product and lifestyle design, industrial products, lifestyle accessories also it is the same. You have GPT general proficiency test conducted for one hour, design attitude test DAT conducted for another hour and then you have the personal interview round. A total then you have UG business courses. Now that is for fashion. Now you have for business courses. For business courses here you don't have the designing round which is design aptitude test. You only have general proficiency test and the interview round general aptitude test again it is conducted for one hour the different sections under the business section are media and communication journalism entertainment fashion and lifestyle business management uh, global luxury brands management advertisement and marketing section for any of the following sections under business ug you can always have the same examination pattern which is general proficiency for one hour conducted and the personal interview round. Next for PG and professional courses in the designing stream you have 
the same again general proficiency test design aptitude test and personal interview the sections i would be reading out design fashion and textiles interior design and styling fashion styling and image image design then communication design then you have fashion communication for business streams it's the same again no design aptitude test you only have the general proficiency test and the personal interview round here you have luxury brands media and communication journalism entertainment or brand management then you have fashion business marketing and merchandising then for masters courses design uh, fashion and textiles here the type of exam or the shortlisting criteria would be as follows here you will not be having the proficiency test or the design aptitude test here you will be having statement of purpose profile evaluation and personal interview these are the three main criteria out of which candidates are further shortlisted next for fashion marketing you have gpt statement evaluation on the personal interview then for ug diploma courses there will be only personal interview no examination conducted fashion, uh, fashion makeup fashion women's wear fashion styling and interior decoration this is up for the examination pattern and the criteria for marking next you have the syllabus part for syllabus for general proficiency you would be working on the topics which are related to english comprehension english language ability logical reasoning quantitative aptitude and data interpretation alongside you would be actually looking into grammar usage of words sentences and their meanings as well as how you are understanding the language and putting it into action next for design aptitude creativity drawing design ability power of observation and imagination sensitivity to environment and communication skills you should also alongside work on the different patterns and trends which are evolving in the market which will help you to understand as to what exactly the customer or the person who is heading forward needs this will help you analyze better and be much more creative next off you have uh media aptitude test mat you have creative thinking which means you should be actually working on a brand advertising marketing and also creating logo designs or dialogues and expressions writing screenplay command of over the language and how you are using the language to portray the brand in the first place what actually the logo is speaking then uh, short report writing power of observation human behavior and knowing out the virtual elements so these are the different topics for the different sections of the exam if you have further uh, queries regarding this don't forget to place them in the comment section thank you so much for watching till the end also don't forget to subscribe as well to precious now channel for more informative videos regarding entrance exams thank you so much for watching